Talk to us about how practice went today. Again, I thought we uh, came off the field uh, feeling like we, we uh, accomplished a lot. Uh, we're being challenged a little bit at some positions injury-wise. I, I know that that's uh, forced a schedule uh, change here for the next couple of days. We're, uh, we're going to uh, you know, have to do some things with the schedule to make sure that we can uh, get the most out of the opportunities that we have here to practice. But uh, I continue to like um, the way we're going about our business, you know, in the individual periods and in the, in the, in the, uh, the cross-group parts of things where we compete one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, and our, our, our team periods have been well, uh, have done well. Um, I like, like the, the way we've gone about our special teams uh, circuits the last couple of days as well. Those are things that uh, require a lot of effort, and, and the guys are working hard at those things. So I, it's, it's, it's good to see. Uh, we mentioned them before, but the defensive backs, again, another couple uh, interceptions today. Talk about uh, maybe the progress they've made and how well they performed this spring. Yeah, you know, I think the defensive backfield is, is in, in, in the linebacker positions are two areas that we haven't been stressed at in, in terms of uh, numbers. You know, they've been healthy. Uh, we've, we've practiced 10 linebackers throughout the course of the spring, and we, we've practiced 12 defensive backs. And uh, uh, they're getting a lot of reps. They're getting a lot of work. They're working hard. They're fresh. Um, some of the other positions are really challenged as a – on the defensive front, it's the defensive line that's really getting challenged with numbers. Uh, but those uh, those two groups, and, and in particular the defensive backs, I'm excited to see uh, their abilities. You know, we're young still at that position, uh, with sophomores, uh, juniors to be, but uh, um, the ability level is, is really uh, an impressive part of our, our operation. Uh, I like the fact that we're catching the football in the secondary, too. We're, we're getting the balls and we're catching the ball. Uh, and one of the things we talked about in the off season, Andrew, was uh, getting the balls, but we're not putting the finish on it. We're not making the interception, and I think that's something that uh, we're really trying to emphasize. And then, you know, with the interception comes a change of field position and a possible score. You see so many times in in this game nowadays where uh, a turnover can result in uh, in points. So we're trying to feed that uh, mentality to our players on, on the defensive side of the ball and. Uh, and uh, make that a very valuable and important part of our, our operation. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, changing gears now, Coach. A uh, week from today will be the uh, Jeff Cole Memorial Bone Marrow Drive from 3 to 7 p.m. at the Student Recreation and Fitness Center. Uh, if you could give us uh, a little bit of background and about uh, what that is uh, all about. Well, uh, we have, um, for the past three years, uh, been involved in a, a bone marrow drive working with the uh, uh, National Bone Marrow Drive uh, through the efforts of Coach uh, Andy Talley at Villanova, who's rallied uh, the teams in our conference and the teams throughout the Northeast in support of this uh, bone marrow match program. Um, it, it's something we've committed ourselves to in honor of Jeff Cole um, and his uh, uh, experience here, his, his, the work he did for us as a coach here before succumbing to cancer. and. and 2004, and um, our team has rallied around that on on Main Day in the past. With uh, we started with a blood drive, and we've moved now to the bone marrow match program. Um, Main State of Maine Leukemia Foundation will be here to help and assist our team uh, in the recruitment of, of young people, old people, uh, campus and community people uh, to come in for a match. It's a quick 20-minute uh, operation. It's uh, not like a, a, a blood drive or a um, in, in that regard, um, and it's something we'll do here uh, right up at our, our rec center, our beautiful campus rec center, uh, uh, in, in conjunction with Dave Mahan and the folks up there that are helping us uh, on, on that uh, uh, in that area. Uh, and it's just something that we'll be doing from 3 to 7 next Wednesday on Main Day uh, as uh, a way of us recognizing, obviously, Coach Cole, but also giving uh, uh, to the community and, and to this great endeavor in support of, uh, of bone marrow.